Ladies and gentlemen, today's video is going to be on how to tell if your hive is queenless and have, if they are queenless, did they ex readily accept the mated queen that you bring to them. This is my one of my two new Buckfast breeder queens from Canada. Not to get confused with those Africanized ones from Texas. But this hive was made queenless yesterday. I just went through it, made sure there was no queen cells because all I had over in this hive from the other one was cat brood and honey and pollen. Now you see the way they're all over the queen cage. Now if they move out of the way when I just move my finger across, that means they've accepted her already. They're dying for a queen. They know they're hopeless, hopelessly queenless. If they're stuck like Velcro, they don't want her. They think they have a queen. Or they just don't like her. So here goes. Look how easily they get out of the way. They know they're hopelessly queenless. They're ready for mama to be released. I'll put her in here anyway in, in the cage for three days. And then I'll release her sometime Monday afternoon. But as I said, they're just moving right out of my way. But if, it, if they had not accepted her already, not wanting her, it'd be like pulling Velcro apart. You couldn't get them off that queen cage. So there's today's tip for you from Wooly Bees. Like and subscribe the videos. That way you get a email notification every time I put a new video out. I do sell newts and queens. Eventually here, sometime in the near month, I'll be having buckfast queens. I also have Caucasians. I'll be doing the same thing today. I bought two Caucasians. Have a great day, because I know I am.